now, ladies and gentlemen, as of right now, Wednesday, October 26th at 7.30 p.m. Central Time, Valve has decided to update CSGO, but it's not really the update we were really expecting. Most people were thinking it was going to be some bug fixes, minor things here and there, but little did we know, it was a very huge update, and they just tweeted out a few minutes ago saying, today we are just the amount of Rio player and team stickers for readability, so they weren't blending in very well, now they are going to look a little better, very similar to when Stockholm and Antwerp really changed the glitter effects around, where the glitter looked absolutely horrible they updated them to look a little better and more readable and more visible they also added limited time storage units that comes with all the stickers not the golds but we'll get into that later in the video now if you guys are new to the channel make sure you hit that like button and of course subscribe and here's a quick word from our video sponsor skins monkey now today's video sponsor is of course skins monkey skins monkey is currently the easiest and also fastest way you can buy but most importantly trade your csgo skins all you have to do is make sure you have your trade link and on your first trade if you have a leftover balance it goes towards your current balance that can be used the next time you end up trading skins. It has three ways you can inspect, but most importantly has a very in-depth inspect feature that you can see corners on a Karamit for an example, you can't really see otherwise unless you have the item in-game. If you end up topping up your balance, make sure to use promo code MANDO to get up to a 35% deposit bonus and a free $5 on the first trade. So this is actually very, very exciting for me. I haven't been this excited for a CSGO update in a little while. I feel like I'm more excited for this than the actual release of the Real Major stickers. And if we click on the blog post for 10 2022 it says various adjustments for like visibility is done and they said introducing two limited time rio 2022 storage units available for purchase let's check this out in game so if you go to csgo on the main page everything looks the exact same but if you click on this at the bottom not at the top boom things look a little different especially there's more things at the bottom more buyable items which i think this is gonna mess up a whole bunch of stuff on the market but that's a video for another time but this of course you can buy this storage unit the paper sticker storage unit and you get all of these stickers okay these are all papers you get all of the autographs in the game it seems to be and of course the team logos alongside of it this is really cool for people who don't want to unbox and buy every single sticker here and there you get all of them right now which is very very interesting csgo has never done anything like this and i'm very surprised they have done this in my personal opinion let me know what you guys think about this down below the first one is 16.99 usd which i think is kind of pricey in my personal opinion that's kind of crazy the next one up is of course the rio 2022 but with glitter stickers now everyone's wondering are they going to add the golds are they going to add the hollow versions i would assume not because this would really affect investments in my personal opinion and really affect the market for a multitude of different reasons because they have done this glitter stickers in my personal opinion are going to be practically worthless paper stickers are already worthless but they're going to be pretty much gone down the toilet at three cents or even lower possibly to not even make money because there are going to be so many of them if people buy them so if they release more of these with golds or hollows for example later on this could really change major investing forever and that's really about it this in my personal opinion is one of the biggest updates inside of csgo for majors that we've really ever seen and taking a look at some of these glitters it looks like the transparency of the actual autograph looks a lot better they stick out a lot more they stand out a lot more and it looks like the glitter effects are a little better on this as well and it seems to be that valve has also not just updated these storage units but regular storage units as well so if we go to my storage units at the very bottom ladies and gentlemen we're going to scroll down let's just go to let's just go to cases okay we're gonna retrieve a bunch of cases okay so you can actually oh my god you can move things in and out of your storage unit relatively pretty quickly now this is new this is very new okay we're gonna go right click on cases to deposit let's go all the way down to the bottom it looks a lot faster and it looks like you can search this up at the bottom which is also new as well very cool very nice now the speed of these is not changed whatsoever you cannot upgrade the speed it's the exact same and i actually talked about this recently on mando monday on how this was a good and also bad thing of using a third party site like case move that was a big question because the inspect feature and getting things in and out of storage units was so bad people were having to use third party software i was one to not really suggest that at any point in time you know there's third party services could get shut down they could end up with you of a vac ban is that very likely probably not that's just why i don't use any of that that's pretty much besides the point let me know what you guys think i am very excited for this up Update. it looks very very interesting these storage units i think are really going to affect supply for the long run of things for rio let me know what you guys think peace out guys